Hello everyone, this is Lysander, and I am going to show you a quick review of how to use a book and quill. So, first you have, you have to get a book and quill out of your inventory. Now, you don't actually have to grab one out of creative mode. You can also make one yourself. I'll show you how to make one. You'll need one letter. Hmm. And a piece of paper. And actually, three pieces of paper to make a book. Next. So, next, you'll need a crafting table, in this case, since I'm in creative mode. And then, you should place down this, then you create a book in this pattern, a one book. Then, you'll also need a ink sack. What would the ink sacks be? Okay. You'll need an ink sack and a feather. Then you go into the crafting table. You put the book right here, the feather right here, and the ink sack right here. What do you got? A book and quill. Next, you right click on the book and quill. And then, you can type whatever you want in it, like, such as this. I'm going to do a homework. This is for my dad, Ed, so I'm going to make this so, just okay. Yep, sure. Okay, um, so... Anyways, we can actually make this into a homework book, into homework. So, of course, I'm going to know all the answers to the questions. Because I'm the one writing them. So, are you going to do 24? <laughs> Math problem? Yep. So... Anyways, you can do some something as simple as this, or something as hard as this. Wait. You and and still, oh, oh, you on this. All you'd have to do is give this one of these to your students, mm -hmm. and then how do you sign it then at the end? And to sign it, all you have to do is this. Oh, you have to enter a book title. Something like this. My homework by Lysan. So Whoa. what? Look at this. Wait, nice. click it, and it shows up all these. So it's it's pretty easy to use books and quills. Well. Goodbye, everyone. This is the end of my video. If you like this video, please subscribe. Goodbye! Press that button.